Ashton Khan, great double road win at the weekend. What are your thoughts about what happened in London and Newcastle? Uh, my thoughts is just we came out, we came out aggressive, we came out strong. Uh, the team playing together. Um, we knew it was going to be a tough weekend. Going into that weekend, we knew where we sat in the table, and we knew that we c we couldn't afford to drop either of those games. Um, we talked about Musk getting at least one win out of those two, but obviously, definitely, um, we wanted to get both wins. So after the first quarter in Newcastle, we knew uh, we were right there. Coach told us that uh, just play hard all the way through, um, stay together and stay the course, and we'll win this game. And uh, really show throughout the game, um, just staying together, um, just playing hard together, getting that win. And um, that was a big road win, scoring 112 points up at Newcastle in their home gym um, after they came off a big win, winning the Cup uh, final. I know. And um, we brought that momentum out, out to London. Uh, we didn't take no days off. Saturday we were right back into training and back to video and film and focusing on London. And um, it showed in that third quarter in London, the guys played tremendous, went on a 20-0 run. And uh, you can see um, we're starting to come together. Um, obviously, it's a new group, so it uh, kind of takes a while. This group's taking a little longer um, to gel, but you could see that uh, we're capable to beat a uh, any team. A couple weeks back, we beat Sheffield by a good margin. We just beat London by a good margin, and we beat the uh, top team in the league as well on the road. So you can see what the potential is for the Worcester Wolves. It was a fantastic performance in both games. What do you think has been the catalyst for this improvement in the team? I mean, obviously the team is starting to gel, but that was, like I said, there was real aggression from the team, real team camaraderie. What has been the real kick which pushed the team forward? Um, I think a big thing on it is rim protection, um, and uh, the guards are really pressuring the uh, the opponents now. Where uh, Merrick and myself and Danny Huffer were really uh, pressuring the guards, um, trying to force them to make decisions. And um, the training sessions, uh, Coach PJs have have us going hard um, for the whole week, um, really focusing in. We're just locked in. We're staying together. Um, the fan support's been great. Um, all those things uh, mixed into one just uh, leads up to a, a big explosive weekend like we just have. And uh, we know uh, what Worcester Wolves wants to represent and what they have represented in the past, always at the top of the table. So um, I feel like we, the wins that we got this weekend are what we're supposed to be doing um, throughout the whole season. So the team and myself felt very confident going into that weekend. Next up, sorry, Scott, just here at the University, University of Worcester Arena. How do you feel that game will go? Another victory? Yes, we're looking for uh, care, keep carrying on the momentum, not taking no days off, working hard, and um, it's a big game for us. Uh, one, it's the uh, one-off game, so the winner wins the head-to-head. -head. Um, right now it's split 1-1, so we want to get that head-to-head -head for sure for that playoff race. And two, we want to set a tone going into that trophy game the following weekend. So. Uh, there's no motivation, uh, nothing really to be said needed. The motivation's already there. Um, so it's going to be a big uh, big game for us, and um, we're looking to get a big win. Obviously, the first couple times we played them, uh, Big Mo um, wasn't a part of our team at the time, so that's a big attribute to the team. So we're looking just to come in there, carry the momentum that we have from this weekend, and we're looking to have a big performance in front of the crowd and show them uh, what we've developed over the weekend. That's great. Cheers, Ashton. Thank you.